Hey kids, are you in the mood for a horribly depressing portrait of suburban monotony, abuse and neglect? Featuring some graphic scenes that make me, a fully grown man, hide behind his hands? If so, then boy do I have the short film for you. Cutting Moments is a 25 minute experience full of moments of cutting. I fucking knew it! Hedges get trimmed. Food is chopped. Body parts are brutally self mutilated with snip snip scissors. <coughs> Hold on, we're getting ahead of ourselves. The short film opens on a bland American suburbia, where a young boy is playing with his Power Ranger toys in a rather suggestive manner. Let's do it, guys! Right. It's morphin' time! Right there, Tom! Implied sexual abuse. The father catches this display and tries to put a stop to it. Got something to hide, you dodgy shitheel? Just look at him. He reminds me of Dylan Baker's equally messed up character in the film Happiness, which was released around the same time. Fuck both these chuds. The family's detached home life shuffles on through a painfully quiet limbo. The wife is crumbling apart constantly reflecting on the good old days, back when her husband used to pay attention to her, back when he wasn't a kiddie fiddler on the roof. Oh dear lord. She makes one last desperate attempt to snap the man out of his gormless thousand yard stare by getting all gussied up. <laughs> wow, she looks lovely. What could go wrong? Well, I've jinxed it now, because an awful lot can go wrong. Instead of recounting the rest of the plot, I will give you some haunted blowfish tips for a happy home. Tip number one, no phones at the dinner table. Tip number two, don't use fucking steel wool as makeup remover, you Jesus. Cutting moments comes from the mind of Douglas Buck, the cynical fuck. A self-confessed amateur at that time, and an electrical engineer by trade, Buck was given the resources to explore his creative passions by the new school of social research. Like his short film, Home, Buck jumped headfirst into this landscape of domestic terror, tapping into notions of family troubles that almost everyone can relate to on some level. It proved a hit on the festival circuits, and Buck eventually combined Cutting Moments and Home with another similar short film, titled Prologue, to create the feature film anthology Family Portraits, a trilogy of America. But focusing back on Cutting Moments, this is truly controversial material. I have technically seen more shocking content in other films, <laughs> but sometimes certain imagery just evokes a major visceral response. It's the kind of shit that should be appearing in all those annoying horror TikTok channels, where the only way to get noticed there is to rant about 10 most disturbing films, part 6, don't watch it alone. I would love to discuss the ending, but frankly, I don't want to face YouTube's trigger happy ban hammer. So, here's a cute cat video instead. <laughs> With the gruesome effects supervised by none other than Tom Savini, Cutting Moments is rated W for wince. It is a cutting piece of media in every sense of the word, so don't go into it lightly. Yet, I still recommend it as a relatively quick watch through some awfully painful topics. I just feel bad for all the little children trying to find a walkthrough for the cutting moment mission in Pokemon Snap before stumbling into a lady's jiggly puffs getting absolutely brutalised. Pikachu's gonna need a lot of therapy.